Hi there everyone, this is Eric with VBAHowTo.com and coming at you with a video and this video is called How to Open Up a Form to a Specific Record and we're using Access 2016 so uh, actually this can be done in any any version of Access that you're that you're working with right now but uh, we're using Access 2016 and basically I'm um, taking the information from our sample database here um, the Northwind database so all this is are these are customers this is table information table data from the from the, for Northwind so uh, as I go down through here as you can see I have the customers IDs and the customer information here and here I have a button view order for this customer and bang I should see orders for Foleg or this guy's name or whatever I don't even want to say it but uh, view order for this customer bang and sure enough I get I open up a form FRM orders and I see all the information for this customer right here and I could do that with <clears throat> with any of my other customers here uh -huh. call me bang okay great so basically it's real this is real simple uh, notice one thing here that the ID is a, a text value a string value um, and by the way, if you go to vehowto.com, you can get the get the code for this. Um, and make sure that if you're getting value from these videos, subscribe to the channel and click the like button. We'd like to get this video up to three likes. Okay, three likes. I don't think that's very very hard to do. Okay, so. So here, like I was saying before, this is a, a text value. So you're gonna have to put this text value in in uh, uh, quotation marks. Uh, control alternate F11. Bang! I bring up the uh, uh, held it down too much. Alternate F11 brings up my brings up my VBA editor. So what, after I click the button, the button, meaning this button right here, V order for this customer, I'd say give me the uh, give me the order, open up the the order form basically in in a data sheet format. Okay, data sheet format. Even though I set the set the form as a data sheet, this particular form. It's not gonna. It's not gonna open up a data sheet. It kind of freaks out and goes back to uh, just being a single form. And anyway, no big deal. I just force it. Sometimes you gotta force things. And so, uh, data sheet. And then we have the we have this. This the the final argument. It's a where. It's a where argument. It's a filter. Okay, the where condition. The condition is customer ID, and then here, here's where I have to put these quotation marks because I'm, I'm trying to find a string value. You don't have to do this with a, an actual numeric value. You just have to do it with the string variable. And so I put the quotation marks around it. So when I put it all together, I go bang, and there we go. So again. Uh, leave your comments if you have specific questions in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to this video. Come on out to vbahowto.com and you can get the code for the for the uh, for the video for the items in the video. Thanks a lot for watching and until the next video, bye.